Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Sarah with Poor Choices by Sarah. Um, I know you're thinking, Sarah, you already started without us. No, well, yeah, I tried to. I started a video and I dumped my entire cup of layered paints over. Yeah, so I had to stop, mix new paints, and now we're going to try this again and let's hope that I'm not klutzy enough to do it a second time. But at the same time, I would not put anything past me. So, 2020 canvas. It has blue painter's tape on the back to make it all nice and neat. Um, I've already started putting a pillow down, but all of my paints, I'm using the same paints as that I used in the last video. Um, the Galaxy Pour, the one with the glow in the dark paint. So I'm using all the same paints, except I'm not using the glow in the dark paint. And instead of the turquoise deep, I actually mixed um, Cobalt Teal by Master's Touch and then I mixed in the Turquoise Deep by Master's Touch and then I put in a little bit of like a shimmery paint to make it, you can see it just a little bit. So I did that and then I had to mix up, I had to mix up some more gold and I had to mix up some more um, of the Color Shift, of the Color Shift Folk Art Purple Flash because I had used it all. So. Here we go, round two. Oh yeah, there's there's that much paint. I saved the rest of the cup, so I'm going to try to dump that on a um, canvas somewhere. But <laughs> I'm so sad. That's so much paint that I lost. All right, so here we go. We're going to start our cup. <clears throat> so we're going to... I don't trust myself. I always put too much white in. So today I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going to quality control myself. Enough. Then I'm going to do the color shift. Yeah, go, go back and look, watch the last video that I did so you see how I mixed all my paints. I described them in the video. <clears throat> Prussian blue. Yeah, I've got to clean off this table somehow so that it's level again because right now it is most definitely not level and that's why I tipped my cup over and the fact that I'm klutzy but sapphire we got purple Gold. Please don't fall. White. I do more gold. Color shift. Purple. Oh my gosh, if I knock something else over again, I'm going to cry. It just takes so much time to like mix your paints and then you put money into it and then it's just gone. <laughs> I hope this color looks good with the other ones. I think it's pretty on its own. Okay, I'm gonna 
use the very last of this sapphire. All right, so I'm going to use the last of this purple and be done with that too. So I'm so scared to set this down anywhere here. I'm going to set it over here. Here's the top of our cup. So we're gonna pour. I'm gonna be quiet so I can focus. All right, so now I'm gonna pour. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of this blue. Just get me around the circle. Oh no, that dripped. See it? Okay.
hard to get this one apart over here. Okay, so after we poured our paint, then I took white paint and I had a little bit of Prussian blue left and then I covered the rest of the canvas with it. So what I'm going to do is stretch the paint out and it'll all this white paint will allow it to just glide on top. So here we go. Ooh, that's pretty. I'm trying not to let any, oh, I got a little bit on that side, but I'm trying not to let anything really go over the edges. I'm just trying to kind of stretch it out right now. Ooh, those are pretty so far. That's pretty. So I'm going to torch it again real quick. weight of the paint we're going to go down this way speck of paint on there for my gloves, but that's okay. That'll come off. Yeah, there it goes. Make 
wash all my corners have paint on them. Do we like it? Might torch it one more time and see if more cells. I think more cells will definitely come up in that dark depression blue part, part next to the purple. That color shift uh, paint will also sell up if I hit it with a torch. All right, torch it one more time. get anything to come out right here. Well, look at that. Come out in places. Pretty sure those cells are going to grow and the little ones in the background might come up a little bit more too. There's cells growing through there. I love these cells. Love, love, love that. Um, I almost think that I should have mixed my gold. I don't know if it's too thick. I think I should have done a little bit thicker. Like I should have mixed it thicker but done thinner layers of it if that makes sense because it's a pretty chunky line I got going on there. Yeah, I love this. Really like that. That's really pretty. Loving that. I don't know. Let me let me see if I can bring you down. See if I can show you up close. Loving those cells. They're beautiful. I also really love the center part. And like I said, all those cells are gonna grow. Oh, look at those. Like three toned cells. I love the band up top. beautiful so what do you think if you guys enjoyed my video make sure to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel please let me know what you would like me to paint in the future and I can see what I can do I'm still learning and growing every day and experimenting and um, having so much fun with it so thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a wonderful day thanks bye